Hi, I'm Juan Osuna from Osuna Karate in Calgary. Osuna Karate is a proud member of Sport Calgary. Ta! Karate is a Japanese martial art. The actual name is Karate Do. Kara means empty, Te means hand, so empty hand. So hand uh, is an art without weapons. And Do means the path, so it is the path of an empty hand. So Juan, tell me what separates or what makes uh, Osuna Karate different mm -hmm. from all the rest? It's our passion and our commitment. We're, we're very family oriented. Our youngest student is probably four years old. Our oldest is 60. And in between, we have people that do it for recreational purposes, but we also have elite athletes. We have elite athletes from, uh, from able body to para. So we have some people that compete on the, on the para side, which is one of our prides. I mean, we've been, uh, we've been recognized uh, very well in the city for our work with para athletes and with people with disabilities. So we have kids with uh, cerebral palsy. We also have uh, children with autism. All of our students, even the ones that are that have international medals and, and the elbow by the side, they're proud of standing beside somebody who is fighting their disability to, to work hard. And you know, there's nothing more inspiring than, than having somebody who has a, a motor disability and trying so hard and you're like, oh, I woke up with a headache today, but if this guy is doing it, I'm like, eh, right? That gets you going. My son, Santiago, has cerebral palsy. We use karate for his therapy, right? We do not have a separate class. We have an inclusive class where everybody trains together. And it's actually super nice because I actually yeah. thought some parents weren't gonna, weren't gonna feel comfortable, but the feedback is you see the parents of the kids with able body actually have come to me and say, you know, I am so glad, so glad my kid is in this class with, and learning right beside people that have disabilities because that's part of the learning experience. Right? That is part of what I want my kids to learn, and that's the way we do it here. I'm Santiago Osuna, part of Osuna Karate. I'm the Paralympic athlete here, and I've been doing karate for 11 years. For me, growing up um, with a physical disability, it was hard to uh, walk around and move around, so karate for me it helped with my motor system and to, to actually my brain to get you know right leg first and then punch. It helped with those types of um, connections, and for me, that helped with my physical growth. A lot of people would think that uh, they would seem mean, that if they go easy on us, it's like nice and respectful. But for me personally, I like when uh, people go as hard as they can with uh, anyone else because it makes me practice more and makes me better as an athlete. There's very little literature on, on karate for people with disabilities. It's all empirical knowledge. It's like, let's figure it out, right? And, and it's a whole discovery process wow. that has been very educational. Mm. Amazing. Let's talk a little bit more now about your programs that you offer here. The Little Tigers, for example. Yes. Teaching for the four to six year old crowd is very different. We started our Little Tigers program, which is geared for kids from four to six. I call it our pre-karate. It's a karate intro. So we teach them a lot of karate moves, but we also teach them to have fun because it has to be fun. If it's not fun, they're never going to learn. Juan, what are the physical and mental benefits of karate? Physical is very obvious. I mean, you're using your entire body. You know, just by the fact that you lift your legs and kick, you're working your abdominal muscles and it all stands for what requires and all that. Mentally, you know, we, we can't train as a group, but at the end, it's an individual activity. Your biggest challenge is yourself. I mean, it's you trying to improve how do I get faster, how do I get stronger, how do I can block, how do I get out, how do I defend myself, all those questions that you're posing yourself and you challenge yourself every day to try to get better. That's one of the things that make karate progress worldwide, right? right, is, right. is the fact that you don't you don't need to move at anybody's pace. You have to move at your own pace, right? So how can I start? Hey, anytime, anytime. Two of our, our adult black belts, they started with their children, their ladies, and then the children quit and they stayed. <laughs> <laughs> Calgarians, how can they get involved in, in what you offer here? Yeah, uh, uh, just give us all those details as to how they can join. For sure. The best thing would be visiting our web website is www.osunakarateoptogether.com. Uh, there you're going to find the information of where are we located, our programs and cost and everything that you want to know. And if you have any questions, just click where it says info and send us an email 
or call us uh, and we'll give you the information we're looking for. We have two locations. We have one in, in Cougar Ridge. We operate at uh, the gym at the Waldorf School. And here at Spring Bank, this one is our own location. You can choose either or, or you can alternate if your schedule doesn't work. Also, we invite you to come and try it for free. We also always offer two classes for free. I'm a parent, and I know that sometimes kids think they want to try something, and then after they try it, you pay, then you get stuck with a new gay and all the equipment, and they didn't like it after a week. So we always offer one or two classes for free, so your kids can really know whether they like it or not. It's wonderful to be here in this new location. It's a beautiful space. Yeah. Thank you so much, Juan, for having us here today. Thank you for uh, coming. And I should say, sen sorry, Sensei Juan. Yes, yes. <laughs> and if you would like to learn more about this sport or any other activity, just check out Sport Calgary's website at sportcalgary.ca.